Hey guys, welcome to my curls. I wanted to do a little video today to explain why I decided to start a YouTube channel and call it Welcome to My Curls. So when I was little, I've always had curly hair and growing up, my mother didn't know what to do with my hair. I didn't know what to do with my hair as a teenager. Um, all my friends had straight hair. Having these curls was not cool when I was younger. Um, so I just did the best that I could and you know, it was what it was. So fast forward into, I'm in my 30s and 40s. My daughters would show me things on YouTube and so I would go on there and look for, you know, ways to style my curly hair and what products were curly haired girls using. Um, and I could find lots of curly hair tutorials and people showing, you know, shampooing their hair and doing all this stuff. But I just didn't really see that many people with, with my type of kinky curly hair and dark hair. Um, so then when I decided to transition to my natural silver color and stop coloring my hair, again, I went to YouTube and I made this decision a couple months ago. I searched, I watched video after video and, and typed in my search every way that I could possibly think to type it in. And all I could find were older women, I'm 47, so not women not in my age bracket. I could find women with blonde hair. Um, I could find younger gals who were purposely coloring their hair gray because it's like a fad right now to, to have silver hair. But I, I had a really hard time finding women in my age bracket who had transitioned to silver, who had dark hair like me, and who had curls like me. It, it just was impossible. So when I was making notes and lists and things about it, if I started a YouTube channel, what really could I add to the world by putting things on my channel? And so I'm making all these lists about how to talk about my curls and the silver transition. And then, you know, in two years when this is all grown out and I have my whole head is silver, and what else am I gonna talk about? And it occurred to me that I am so much more than my hair. I have actually started four businesses. Um, right now, Craving the Curls is where I am. I do this full time. I feel like I have a lot to offer the world to, when I talk about bookkeeping and business and branding and just the behind the scenes of the business world of running your own business, being an entrepreneur. Um, people are interested in what goes on actually at craving the curls. They want to talk about sprinkles and chocolate syrup and flavors and you know all, all of those fun things. It's super exciting and fun to me so I would love to talk about it and I do feel like I have a lot to say when it comes to the business world. And then in 2018 we decided to franchise Craving the Curls Road Ice Cream. So again, I went to YouTube. I didn't understand franchising. It's this big scary word. Um, a world that I don't know anything about. So searched on YouTube over and over and over and really the only thing that I could find about franchising was how to buy into a franchise, which is not what I was doing. I am the brand. I'm creating the franchise. I could find men in suits sitting at conference tables with a bunch of spreadsheets and pie charts talking very formal about you know, the business side of how to franchise your, you know, whatever you're doing. That did not interest me. I wanted to find a woman who had franchised her brand and I wanted that woman to talk to me. I wanted to watch videos. I wanted to be able to comment. I wanted interaction with somebody that I felt a connection with. And that just did not exist on YouTube for me. So along the way, when I decided to create this YouTube channel, I realized that all of those other things about me are so important and I, I feel like I have a lot to tell the world, not just about my hair, but also about my business and my knowledge and the things that I've learned being a business owner and now franchising our brand. So I think that I want to take you with me on the journey and I think it's going to be interesting it's going to be crazy. I don't know what's going to happen from day to day, but I have a lot to show you. Um, you're going to be able to see what goes on in our ice cream shop. I'm going to show you the behind the scenes of how we have franchised our brand. We have our first franchise location opening in St. Louis in the spring. So I'm going to take you with me as we go through that process. 
Um, it's super exciting to me. I hope it's exciting to you. I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. Welcome to my curls and just take the journey with me. See ya.